everybody so i'm preparing myself to head out um packed my lunch um basically i have chicken and you don't see the meat but there's like steak under there somewhere and rice and onion onions so basically rice with gravy <laughs> and um steak and some potatoes then i have a salad with arugula spinach um cucumbers and tomatoes then I have um, a breakfast snack just in case I get hungry on my way. It's basically just oatmeal, raisins, and bananas. Um, with the lunch, I have some rolls. And really, those are old, old king rolls that I tossed in the oven. I didn't know I had it on toasters, so <laughs> that's why it looks funny like that. I probably would have been better off making homemade drop biscuits. And then for dessert, I have black cherry Greek yogurt. I have my water bottle, so that's my lunch. Um, I'm going to say this. I'm really annoyed by... Hunt and Frederick, I really don't want to get into this, but I will. Stop leaving comments on my page because you're getting on my nerves. And the reason that you're getting on my nerves is because I understand where you're coming from. And I'm glad that it's helpful to you. But the light that you put on my stuff, like I said, you're the same as a troller, except on the opposite end. And you don't intend to be. And it's so funny how when you look at other people, you see parts of yourself. And I can see there's a... I can see kind of how where I would annoy people on the same note. It's just because everything that you put, it comes, it sounds like it's coming from a thing of desperation, but it's not. And I understand your struggle because I've been there. Just like when you put that comment, and I deleted it because it just got on my nerves about, oh, I'm working towards independent living too. I'm going to make, the, you know, what it does is that it puts that light on my thing. I've been living independently all my life, except when I was court ordered to homelessness by the legal system because of a false accusation and whatever and I guess because I didn't have family or whatever they wanted to make sure I didn't go anywhere but I mean but when you put comments like that it makes it seem like we're in the exact same boat and we're not you know not to say that any situation is better or less but it's different and I have enough struggles without you putting your light on my shit <laughs> you know what I'm saying so it's like you know, keep that shit to yourself, you know, work on it and prove it on your own, you know, and it's just, or do your own channel and you can make your comments there, but I don't want it on my page. To me, you're the same as that Gene G Boone guy. You both are just annoying. Um, it really, you irk my nerves more than G Boone because he's just an asshole, you know what I'm saying? And, you know, whatever, but you irk my nerves because you pull at the, the negative, like you pull people down with that, you know, I don't like it. You know what I'm saying? So keep your comments to yourself. You know, just do what you got to do. Make your own channel and put your shit there. You know what I'm saying? If you feel a certain way, put it there. I'm glad it's helpful to you. But like I said, what it does is it puts my shit in the same light. And it's not. Because when you say, oh, I'm working towards independent living too, then it would.